12 unforgettable moments when Dmitry Bivol unleashed his fierce side. Kicking off our knockout list at number 12 is the stunning mimicry maneuver by Viola in amateur boxing. This remarkable event occurred at the 2014 All-Russian Dynamo Tournament in the city of Kazan, leaving the audience absolutely spellbound. <laughs> Moving on to spot number 11, we highlight the electrifying match between Dmitry Bivol and Kazakhstan's own Danabek Sujanov, which took place in the year 2013 under the semi-professional banner of the World Series Boxing. The duel was as swift as it was stunning, with Bivol sealing a victory over his Kazakhstani opponent in the very first round. A precise and powerful strike from the right hand was all it took to clinch the triumph. Not in his best. There's the knockdown! Left right to play! Goodness gracious me! 33 seconds in round one! And there's the first count! Danabek Sujanov sent to the canvas, and that's it! It's all over! My gracious me! On November 28, 2014, Dmitry Bivol stepped into the professional boxing spotlight for the first time, facing off against Jorge Rodriguez Oliveira from Uruguay. The match took place in the iconic Luzhniki Arena, which at that time was regrettably not bustling with fans. Little did the audience know they were witnessing the rise of a future boxing luminary. Bivol, showcasing his prowess right from his debut, dominated the fight, leaving no openings for Oliveira. The bout concluded with a decisive technical knockout, heralding the arrival of Bivol as a formidable force in boxing. At number 9, the clash between Dmitry Bivol and Konstantin Peternov stands out. In April of 2015, an electrifying match unfolded. The initial two rounds sailed on relatively calm seas, with both fighters evenly matched, a natural outcome given the higher caliber of the opponent. Yet, the advantage subtly tipped in favor of the native Kyrgyzstani talent. Come the third round, Dmitry refused to play the waiting game. Instead, he stormed out of his corner with a barrage of punches, cornering his adversary and delivering a decisive knockdown. <laughs> Pitanov, battered and bruised, managed to claw his way back to his feet and made the bold choice to continue the fight. Sensing weakness, Dmitry, with the scent of victory in the air, launched a ferocious assault, aiming to put an end to the struggle. Recognizing the gravity of the situation, Konstantin's corner, in a swift act of mercy, threw in the towel to protect their fighter from further harm. Just six months after his debut fight, Dmitry Bivol was presented with an incredible opportunity to showcase his talents against the formidable Ugandan fighter Joe Vegas on the undercard of an Alexander Povetkin event. A chance like this was something the native of Kyrgyzstan simply couldn't allow to slip through his fingers. 
That evening, he displayed remarkable prowess, knocking his opponent to the mat twice in the third round. He then followed up with a brutal finish in the fourth, leaving an indelible mark on those who witnessed his ascent in the ring. On August 27, 2015, Dmitry Bivol made his debut in the mecca of modern boxing, facing off against Mexican competitor Felipe Romero. Throughout the match, Bivol was like a predator in relentless pursuit of his prey, strategically maneuvering his way around the ring. His persistence paid off when he finally cornered Romero, delivering a decisive triumph in the eighth round. on his path to the pinnacle, Dmitry Bivol carved out his latest victory in the ring against Brazilian contender Jackson Jr. Bivol dominated from the onset, meticulously dismantling his opponent with precision and strategy. In the second round, a thunderous right straight from the Kyrgyz native floored the Brazilian, showcasing Bivol's formidable prowess. Looks a little bit unsteady, Jr. He's trying to fire back. Get a king because Jackson tried to throw a right hand. Oh, oh, it's down. Right hand put him away. Got another one on the way down. The pressure from our hero only mounted thereafter, and a subsequent knockout in the fourth round was an irrefutable testament to his strength and technique. Following this assertive takedown, the bout was decisively called off, marking yet another defining moment in Bivol's ascendancy within the boxing realm. Oh, there he was. That was the opening he was waiting Six, for. Seven, eight, okay, nine, ten. Oh. And that's terrific right hand. Cool. Just great timing and concentration levels. I'll just make with, with Jackson through his shots a little bit wide. He looks quite impressive. But you, for his fifth fight, I think he, he's tremendously impressive. The fifth fight beat four times, only four times, to be honest. He's had 17 of his fights been by knockoff. The next challenger of the Bivol is the New Zealander known as the Butcher, Robert Berridge. A stunning match finalized in just four rounds. Защита нет. Конечно, не дожмет, но концовка однозначно забивала. Нашумел. Ну, не надо было, конечно, второй удар наносить. Соперник встал. Ну, что, сознательно, мне кажется. Зашла. Продолжает работать Бивал. Ни одного попадает, да. посмотрите. Куда-то выбрасывает туда. Да нет, но абсолютно. Он, он ждет эти удары. Посмотрите, то левое, да. то правое, то правое да. угол сбоку. Все время Еще защита, один очередной нокдаун. On April 14, 2017, Dmitry Bivol stepped into the ring with a decisive change in strategy displaying dominance from the outset against Samuel Clarkson. Embarking on an aggressive offense, Bivol's intense power sent Clarkson to the canvas not once, 
but twice in a palpable display of prowess. <laughs> The second round unfolded at a more measured pace as Clarkson, recognizing the imminent threat from Bivol, adopted a predominantly defensive stance, only occasionally daring to mount a counterattack. In the third round, Bivol's relentless assault continued, unleashing a series of combinations that cornered Clarkson, forcing him to constantly maneuver for safety. By the fourth round, Bivol's calculated ferocity culminated in a single, beautifully executed counter-punch that decisively ended the contest. Six, seven. Clarkson struggled to his feet, a testament to his resilience, but the referee stepped in, declaring the battle over by technical knockout, a decisive victory for Dmitry Bivol. On June 17, 2017, boxing enthusiasts witnessed the electrifying debut of the powerhouse on the legendary HBO channel as he took on the sturdy American Cedric Agnew. Our champion, true to his reputation, had no intention of drawing out the fight, swiftly bringing his opponent to a knee within the very first three minutes. Качнула Седрик Агню и тут же идет добивать и падает Седрик Агню. Отличное начало для Дмитрия Бивола. What followed was a series of rounds that showcased an unrelenting one-sided assault. Agnew, baffled and overpowered, succumbed to the pressure by the fourth round, choosing not to weather the storm of punches any longer. Болельщики гудят, конечно, им не нравится видеть изгнить желанием этот самый бой демонстрировать нам. Да, и имена, конечно, в этом Дмитрия Бивола. Мы говорили перед эфиром о том, что нужно быть что-то с глазом. Больно, сделал больно, сделал больно. Как раз левый боковой. Он пришелся в область глаза. И может быть, может быть, да. кстати, не исключено, да. что это перелом. Да, возможно, возможно. Потому что видно, резкая боль была. In a stunning November 2017 showdown, Дмитрий Бивол faced off against Australian Trent Broadhurst and showcased his undeniable prowess in the ring. It was a swift display of skill by the native of Kyrgyzstan, as he triumphantly sent Broadhurst to Dreamland within the very first three minutes of the bout. There's the judge of distance. Oh, and a beautiful right hand over. It's in a round. And Dimmel explodes onto the world scene and retains his WBA title in emphatic fashion. And it's his pride more than anything. Dimmel knocked out. Wow. Well, there you go, right at the end of the round. I think the bell sounded as you didn't really see it. I mean, it was a right hand down the pipe, sharp, strong and accurate. And in a captivating display of skill and prowess in March 2018, the boxing ring bore witness to a remarkable bout. The Cuban pugilist, Sullivan, entered the ring with hopes of triumphing over the Russian contender. However, the unfolding drama was one of strategic mastery by Bivol, whose systematic dismantling of his opponent over 12 relentless rounds captivated onlookers. With unyielding precision, Bivol culminated his tour de force with a stunning decisive blow, a ferocious right straight punch that sent the Cuban crashing to the canvas. The knockout was as emphatic as it was graceful, marking a triumphant finale to an intense encounter. Is he not going to let him continue? No. It's a stoppage. 
And Bivol oh, gave earlier about he went and how Bivol seems to go into boxer. This is amazing.